Hello everybody and welcome back to Wild Flowers. Where today I'm gonna have to have a quick look at my Oh yeah, today we are still waiting for cauliflowers. Uh we are gonna go and check out Kai's masterpiece at the town hall. We are still looking for the Malasado recipe. Which is intentionally difficult. Um and still waiting for the snowdrops and still waiting for the propagation shed. So we are in a very much uh waiting holding pattern right now. Oh, honey's ready. Nice. It'll be ready quite often now because I've got 20 flowers backing it up. And I don't need the money from any of it. I just like if anyone wants it, I'll just sort that out. Uh, right, so first thing I want to do today, like we do every day, Pinky, is try to, no, uh, try to dig up dirt in the mountain. And see if the recipe pops out. So in the morning we dig up, we dig up the dirt, and then in the evening we do the fishing. Is it? <gasps> Oh, it is a recipe. A recipe? It's stuffed cabbage. Golupsti. Let's see. Uh, Golupsti, I think. But that's two. Let's have a look and see if we can find a third one. not up there it is good though sometimes I uh, I forgot to go to the mountain in the morning one time and then went in the evening instead and got a cutscene with Parker and Lena so <laughs> sometimes it's good to go places at different times I'll need to check out the coven as well but yeah I do wonder whether there will be a reason to turn the season I'm kind of interested because now I've got the greenhouse, I can grow anything at any at any season. So there's no reason to do it for planting uh, purposes. Okay, so I've got everything I want. Let's go to the town hall and check out the masterpiece that Kai's done. Hey Natalia! I, you know, there's a lot of people that say that when they first saw this game and how small the actual map was, they were like, oh, I'm never going to want to... Oh. The town hall closed? Saturday and Sunday closed. Oh, okay, so we won't get to see it today until Monday. Oh, always waiting for Monday, aren't we? Uh, but yeah, they're saying like this is such a small game and yet there's so much to do in it. But not if you're Tara, apparently. I think our best bet today... Oh, how are the... Actually, are the snowdrops ready? Yeah! Our best bet today is to collect the snowdrops then. I think I've got more seeds to plant in, so... And just plug those gaps and take those over to Thomas. Yeah, that's a thing we can do. All of my farmyard things, I've I've got loads of stuff done. Like um, we've got the hayfield, so we we never have to feed the cows and things ever again. Do I get another sheep though? Oh, uh, Marty isn't open on a Saturday. I was thinking I could get another another sheep because we're running a little low on wool sometimes. I'm doing a lot of clothing making right now. Where are you, Thomas? Oh, that's annoying. Oh, there he is. Hello. Here's your snowdrops. Here you go, Thomas. One bunch of flowers for a gorgeous bouquet. Thanks, Tara. Um, can I ask you something? Yeah. Sure. What? Well, I, uh, don't know what I should say. When I ask out Sophia, you're friends with her. What do you think? Be sincere. Just tell her how you feel about her. 
Sophia's kind of a no-nonsense person. Yeah, that's one of the things I like most about her. Huh, okay. Well, I better get these in some water if they're gonna last long enough for me to give them to her. Good luck. Okay. I'm, I'm expecting a cutscene with Sophia or something. Uh, something like that. I, I need to know what goes on with this. Right then. So other than that, we can run around trying to find people's cutscenes. <laughs> so who's likely to be where today? Saturday, Lena will have the shop open. Sunday, she might not. So... Lena's just in here. Nothing really happening. Hey Tara, do you think you could help me out with something? Depends. Bruno's been saying he wants to make a real attempt at staying on the wagon, but he likes hanging out at the bar for the company. Okay. So, I want to make a new zero-proof ale for him. I just need some wheat and a few other ingredients. I grew some wheat recently, I think. I think this is such a lovely idea, Damon. I would be happy to fill up a few plots for you. Thanks, Tara. Uh, we've got the wheat, we've got the hops, we just need some sugar, so let's go and buy some sugar off date, uh, Lena. And give all of that to Damon. Perfect. Here's your wheat, Damon. Thanks. I'll get it started right away. Hey, if you want to try the recipe out yourself, it's super easy. Oh, I love a good recipe. I've been thinking about Otto lately. I always thought it was so unfair how he came after me in the bar. But, you know, Bruno and Vanessa are his only family. What he did was totally wrong, but his heart was in the right place. I'm going to look out for Bruno for him. Alcohol free ale. And I can now make that at my distillery. Lovely. So we're starting to fill up this drink section now. I think the alcohol free ale. Oh, okay. The stuff that can be done at the distillery. Uh, does that fall under this then? Distillery stuff. Yeah. So. Out of the distillery stuff, I've still got one more drink to make. We've got apple, carrot, grape, orange juice, wine, and there's something else. And uh, the alcohol free beer is probably here as well, somewhere, is it? No. So those are things that are made in my shed. But then things like vodka and stuff don't show under drinks either. They show under magical stuff, potions and incantations and distillations. There we are. Got one more distillation to find as well. Okay, nice. Uh... I guess we are fishing for recipes for the rest of the day then. Shall I go to the mine again? The mine's always a good place to go fishing for recipes. Either that or is there anybody that I want to follow? I mean Bruno and Lena are working right now. I could try and follow Lena about after she finishes work. I'd also try and find Sebastian, but it's a Saturday, so it's harder to find. They're easier to find on like a Monday. <laughs> All of the kids are just so much easier to find on a Monday. But maybe actually I'll go to the woods and fish. Fishing in different places is A, good for finding people who might have a cutscene, and B, good for finding bottles, because I think it sometimes helps if you're going into different places, so... I'm going to run back and forward around the lake here. Oh, yeah. 
Okay, there uh, you weren't a bottle, but that's fine. We have to keep trying. Also, I can pick up like scavenger balls around the lake. Peanuts for Ariel. I might go and see Ariel later. Recipe. I'm getting better at knowing when it's the recipe that I'm getting. Is that a bottle? <gasps> With a recipe inside. Mulled wine. Oh, we can go again. Oh! You know, she is actually humming the tune that's playing oh, quick. in the background. I think that's just a salmon. I think that's the rare fish, sadly. I know it's a bluegill. Oh, that's a brand, brand new fish I've never had before. Fantastic. There aren't many brand new fish I've never had before left, to be honest. Bluegill is, yeah, there's only two more in the lake that I haven't found. There's quite a lot in the ocean. There's two in the mountain, and there's one in the mine. So we'll just, yeah, keep on going. Oh, Gloria's here at the moment. Let's have a little chat with you. Sebastian said he's decided to enroll in an online university, for next year at least. Oh, fantastic. I want him to explore the world and have the campus experience someday, but I cried. An extra year with him at home will be such a gift. It will, definitely. Actually, before I give you a gift, I want to know... Oh, yeah, okay. I want to know if the gift, gift is necessary. So, I made a whole bunch of coconut rice for you. What a delicious surprise. Violet's got me onto these, and I can't get enough of them. Food's one of those things I think I miss the most. After my children, of course. That really fills up the heart. Wow, okay. So that probably gives a little bit of a weighting to it because uh, Gloria isn't someone. Uh, sorry, Gloria isn't someone who's, uh, you know, been here since the beginning. So it maybe just tries to help you out with it a little bit. <gasps> Quick! <gasps> Got one. She's always so excited, bless her. Is that a salmon? Oh, it's another bluegill. Bluegill's clearly a thing for this time of the year. Anything over here? Yeah. Just gonna keep going at all the different spots over here just for a bit because something might show up. I maybe run over to the coven and just check on them as well. What's the advantage of being here? Probably just quickly check if anyone has a an exclamation mark over their heads or anything. Oh, maybe grab these. While they're out at night. I remember Grandma Hazel telling me to go and get them. So the most likely people to have some kind of quest for me are those two. Another thing we can do this episode is ask Wesley out to go on a date. Oh, thank goodness. I've, um, all my gloaming flowers I've, I've sorted, so I don't really need to worry about the wellspring and stuff like that at the moment. Which is quite nice. Don't need to, need to worry about going in and getting those. I've got a nice stock of them, so... You sound so happy that you got one, but... Uh, 
I do feel like I need to go into the gloaming and do a bit of fishing in there at some point because again that is a different place. I think it's all about fishing in different places and just fishing a lot in general. Because at the end of the day the mountain only has you know three attempts and you're done each day so if you don't have any quests on the on the line then it's really just a case of fishing. We've got one recipe in from here and I got one recipe from the mountain today so that's two I'm always happy if I can have I get two that's always good um let's fly home I think getting a bit late oh yeah that's for the the day I'm sleepy so we'll do that tomorrow morning, I think. Maybe after I've dug up my mountain stuff, we'll go on a go on a nice Sunday date. It looks like it's a nice day as well. Because I was thinking a picnic date might not do so well in the rain. <laughs> Ooh! My new place is ready. Ooh, I was meant to be making soil for it, wasn't I? Oops. So now we can make propagation mix using seaweed and weeds. Let's make a few of those in, I guess. I mean, you already gave me. This is weird. Plant here with propagation mix will produce eight more seeds instead of the plant's usual produce. Ah, I see. So I'll need the seeds, but I can use seeds to make more seeds. That's pretty cool. Okay, let's go and dig up at the mountain and then we'll go and see where Wesley's gone. kind of given up on bothering about the shiny eggs at the moment they I can have a shiny egg if I want if I want to feed one of uh, my chickens a strawberry then that can happen easily okay no more money one last chance ah it's a day with none nothing let's go <laughs> let's go and see Wesley Still no masaladas. I will keep trying until I get that. I'll probably end up with every single recipe. Are you in the house? No. Uh, probably in his shop right now, isn't he? Let's go and like disturb him. <laughs> and any of the others over there. Like I'll uh, go and give presents out in Ravenwood, I think. So Perry, you are my best friend now, but Why you... Zephyr insists on spending so much time around humans mystifies me. Very few of you are that interesting. But Zephyr is different to you. Zephyr is a goblin. Zephyr is more short-lived. No, I don't need to buy rose water really, do I? Let's uh, buy a levitation potion and like... Magic potion and like crystal ball potion and stuff. Like Perry's shop. Perry shop's great. But yeah, Perry's up at like full now, so it's like you definitely need to just find her in the right place at the right time. Oh, he's still a werewolf in the daytime. I'm so sorry. I think we both deserve a little treat. Would you like to have a picnic with me? That sounds perfect. After you, my love. Hmm, this is our picnic. Oh, oh. <laughs> 
Shelby in the background. Oh, they're looking out over the lake. Enjoying the sun with my sweetheart and this smoked salmon is the stuff poems are made of. We must do this again soon. Wow, that like used my entire Sunday up. I don't even care though. Because I was kind of waiting for Monday. It's a good way to use a Sunday, going on a date with my beloved. <laughs> what a long there. day. <sighs> right then. No propagation mix done? Yeah. Well, only just though. And I knew there was a reason I was keeping these. Tomatoes and things are ready today, but I'm just going to ignore them. <laughs> right, so we can go and check out Kai's painting today. I will spend the morning digging up the hillside, though. Um, I'm certain there's still more for me to find. Might just be at a point where I'm not finding recipes every day. Is it? It is! A recipe! Lemonade! I found... Emmy and Finn's uh, <laughs> secret recipe. And then a bit of money, so that's fine. Okay, let's run over to the town hall. See what Kai has made of it. I'm very, very interested, actually. And then I might do a little bit of working on some clothes. That's another thing that I like to do in my spare time. In my downtime that I just I never seem to have any downtime previously. Oh hey Tara! What do you <gasps> think, huh? This place finally has some personality. Oh, the doll sisters, Hazel. I don't know what the ship's about. Wow. Is that Thomas's family? It's our history. The doll sisters, Thomas's family, and grandma? Yeah. I guess she and Kai had a greater friendship than I realized. Mm. He was always cutting past her place on the way to the beach. Now, she'll always be remembered. It's been a big upheaval, suddenly returning to my life on the island like it was before, <laughs> but also nothing like it was before. Yeah. The kids are being champs, but I'm still trying to get my bearings. Thanks for all your help with this. I feel more at home now. Gosh. Hazel has her picture in here. Oh, that's gorgeous. I'm so happy with that. I wasn't expecting that at all. Right, the kids are in session now. Where's Bastion? Why is he not at school? Oh, you tear him a suit. Yum. I'm not even hungry, but I'll totally make room for this. Oh, we're nearly there, actually. One conversation might hey, do it. I heard you help set up my mom and Thomas. <laughs> yeah, I haven't seen your mom yet. Oh, I wouldn't say I set them up exactly. <laughs> anyway, he's so much better than Marty. Mom actually seems like happy for the first time in a long time. Yeah. So she hasn't been happy. Thanks. Oof. Tomorrow. We'll get Juliet tomorrow. Where's Bastian then? He's left school now, has he? I was going to make him a devil to find. Oh, well. It's 
still nothing from Lena though. Like I'm really, really wondering exactly what's going on with her. What I'm missing there. Who else do we have to do a... Oh, I didn't give Ariel anything yesterday. I gave Perry... Uh, well, I went and checked on Perry. Cameron I need to give stuff to. Gloria. So I was just by. Hi. I see a Shelby around. Here's I will give him a present. Oh, hi. Tara, there's something I've been meaning to say to you. I'm so very sorry about your gran. I knew her death was coming, but it still hurt. Mm. Hazel and Marcus were the only people I could talk to about where I came from. Sometimes I wish so hard they were still here that I forget they're even gone. You can talk to me. I know I haven't been here as long, but... I'll always listen. Yeah. I think... I think I will tell you. Just a bit. I was born in Hungary. Ooh, I know. I don't sound like it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Spent most of my time on these shores after my parents passed. I'm sorry to hear about your parents. They knew it was coming. They were... Uh, I am... Romani. No one read cards better than my ma. But that's a story for another time. <laughs> I think my uh, sharing gears are rusty. <laughs> can... can that happen? You have to practice. Practice makes perfect. And this kind of practice might even be good for you. Huh. We'll see about that. Thank you, Tara. You got all the best parts of your grand. I have a lot to learn about witchcraft, but not to toot my own horn. I know how to be a good friend. Aww. That you do. That you do. That's gorgeous. So Shelby is Hungarian and Romani. Didn't see that coming, was kind of ha half expecting him to be some kind of druid or like from some kind of fairy kingdom or something. <laughs> you know what this game is like. Now then, where do I want to do my mining and stuff today? My, not my mining, my fishing. Do I want to go to the mines? Is that my subconscious telling me that I want to go to the mines? Probably. So let's give Gloria some coconut rice on the way past. If I see Bastian, I'll try and Sebastian's give him something. Sebastian's getting antsy. I know he wants to hear me say that it's okay for him to leave, but I'm not ready yet. Normally, I'd be like, let go, but like, it's kind of understandable. You will be my friend purely from coconut rice. What a delicious surprise. Food's one of those... Yeah. Okay, so that was enough to finish the heart. Um, Gloria at the moment is on second heart, I think. Yeah, we're on second heart with Gloria. Just making sure. <laughs> did we ever manage to get Francis to the best friend level? I think we did, didn't we? Yeah. But still not for Kai. I'm going to run along the beach a bit, I think. Maybe we could fish along the beach a bit today. We don't do that often, actually, do we? And I might find people like Kai, people like Bruno around. Who are all due cutscenes. Francis? There's a lot of people that like to... Oh, I haven't chatted to Sophia since. 
Let's have a chat. Hey, Tara. I heard you grew the flowers Thomas gave me. Thanks. They're beautiful. You're very welcome. So, did you guys have dinner? We need to know. Yes. It was very nice. <laughs> I never really thought I might be ready to move on. But he doesn't seem to mind if we take things slowly. That's really nice. That's so sweet and adorable and lovely. And I am beyond chuffed. That that's where she is with things. Okay, I'm going to head over to the other little bit of the... Ah, Amira, I never give you presents right now, I and I should. I wonder if Vanessa could have gone another way. If someone had just reached her sooner. Maybe. I wasn't born into a witch family either. I also had a friend who brought out my powers. Could I have turned into a dark witch too, if a few things had gone differently? I really don't know on that one. Uh, where's your cookies? It's funny, when I was in med school, my mother used to come fill up my entire cupboard with oatmeal raisin cookies. She knew I would turn to sugary snacks when pulling all-nighters, so she wanted to try to at least make them healthy. I will start skipping that one, uh, probably after this time now. So I've got two hearts worth of oatmeal raisin cookies to get. Beach is covered with pearls. Hey Bruno! Do you think it's ever too late to start over? <laughs> My life's been full of do-overs. It's never too late, brother. Hey there, Tara. Hey, you two. I'm not interrupting anything, am I? Of Course not. I was just about to tell Kai here that I've been considering a move off the island. Hmm. What? Otto's the last bit of family I got. I should be spending more time with him. Yeah, and especially if he and Vanessa are having a load of trouble. I don't know whether he, he and Vanessa are trying to reconcile or what. You and Damon are my Ohana out here. It'd be so weird not having you around anymore, but... Who am I to stand in the way of where the wind blows you, huh? I'm gonna miss you, though. You have the best stories. Hmm... Thanks for that, Kai. What do you think, Tara? Think Otto will have me? Listen to your if your heart is telling you to go, you should. I'm really going to miss you too, though. I'm touched you both feel that way. I suppose I don't need to rush into things, eh? Oh. I can always start with a milkwater marina slip and stay overnight at Otto's once in a while. Yeah, that would be a good idea. See how you like it. And if you like it there and you don't miss here too much, then go over there and just visit here. Besides, I'd hate for him and Vanessa to get sick of me being around. Thanks, you two. Easy to forget families more than just blood. Good friends. Oh, that's interesting. So we had the fishing thing, but that was... Uh -huh. So if I have a chat to you... It's hard, Otto leaving like that. But inside him somewhere is the boy I know. When he comes back, I'll help that boy show his face to the world again. Okay, need a couple of presents for Bruno then. Or just a few chats, maybe. But I do need to keep on with that. I'm gonna chat to Thomas and just ask him about the date a bit more. Now I finally know why Hazel was eh. so sure you'd do well by the farm. Honestly, that was just her good sense. She couldn't see the future. Oh, but Shelby can though. Ah, a lot of the things Shelby said are starting to make sense. I love how the town is getting to like know all about slowly all about the coven stuff. That's really really cool. And then we'll do a little fishy fish around here, see if any bottles show up. 
We managed to get Shelby and Bruno's cutscenes there, which is really cool. Ooh, quick. Can't I was hoping for either Bruno or Kai. Because Kai's due one as well. And Kai was kind of involved in it, but, you know, not quite... I haven't found many bottles down by the sea yet, so oh, yeah. I don't know if I will or if I won't or what's going to happen, but I just keep running around here and trying. A flounder! Well, that's a new one. I am filling in the fish slowly as well, aren't I? But it's just quicker for looking for recipes if I pull up whatever comes first. I'm gonna have to do so much fishing, I've got a feeling I probably will end up finding everything just naturally. Oh, quick! Got one! An oyster. I think I may have caught an oyster before. That doesn't have uh a second go at it, so that's fine. We are getting through this bait at a very rapid speed, though. Oh, hot one! Mackerel. Anything over here? Do we have any more over here? Oh, there's one. I just want to keep trying different places because A, that helps me get more different Got fish one. and B, I've just got a feeling that there might be more stuff there. Like I say, I might do some gloaming fishing as well. But I've, I've never had a bottle in the gloaming or if I have, I've had like one out of there. So as maybe, I, I don't know how it works behind the scenes at all. I'm just kind of hoping, really. Maybe that'll be what we'll do tomorrow. I managed to find loads of cutscenes at the moment, so it's, it's nice to just tie those off. Oh, quick! Gotcha. I do need to work on Wesley very much so. Uh, he needs a present basically every day. Actually, do you know what I might do? Go to Damon's and just go and like buy a load of wine. Then I can give Wesley a wine every day. Uh, I could probably do the salmons he likes as well. He's a bit of a salmon lover, being from Alaska and all. He likes wine, salmon. It's a man of good taste. He really is. Roast beef and roast pork. I buy like 20 wines. <laughs> Don't ask what I need these for, okay? So I need to give something to Kai, a Pokeball or something. So, um, Sebastian said he's going to be a part of Coven 2 when he gets older. That's cool, I guess. <laughs> Can you, like, magic up some perfect rollers for me tomorrow? Sorry, Kai. I can make it rain, though. Nah, don't do that. Then the waves get all disorganized. Oh, so let's see where he's at. Oh yeah, okay, at cutscene time. But we it, it's not a bar thing. It's not a buy a stall thing. It might be an on the beach thing. I have to keep checking the beach for him, I think. We definitely need to give Bruno something. But do we have anything that Bruno likes? No. So, Bruno Soft, what do you like? We don't know. Because it's taken that long for me to get cutscenes with you, mate. <laughs> so that would be what my crystal ball potion. I think I bought one from Perry. That's what I'm going to use it on. One thing that Bruno likes. But yeah, with Wesley, we're going to start on a new heart now. Because we went on our picnic. 
Let's see I'd like you to have it. this, sweetheart. What is it? Parchment? Thanks. Thank you for the beautiful... We could do some, like, boops and face touches and, and stuff. It's really it's adorable, this. Really adorable. I'll give you some wine. I don't want to hear about the detective novels, though. Oh, I... Oof, okay. We've got some ways to go on this, then, haven't we? Wow. It's 11 o'clock, though. It's time for bed. Um, We're still trying to find the... <laughs> Malasada and uh, waiting for the cauliflower to be The cauliflower Is might be ready for though. Bed? So I'll take that to give her in the morning. I think it's, pro if I look in my greenhouse, it's probably ready by now. A lot of stuff in there is. It needs a total revamp, but. So what I can do, I don't know if I can use an actual tomato if I need the tomato seeds. In the propagation shed. Uh, the cauliflowers are going to take two more days, actually. The sweet potatoes are ready, though. I need to go and find Cameron, though. Like, there's no point in having all these sweet potatoes if Cameron's nowhere to be seen. I'm gonna be honest, I'm with him on it, though. Like... Sweet potato fries are yum. Honestly, I probably don't need this much uh, <laughs> sweet potato, but uh, I was just kind of filling the beds. My things that I want to do are to find recipes at the moment, uh, because obviously we need to do that for the quest. Oh, we've got honey to get as well. I needed honey so much early in the game, and now it's just like, honey, honey, all the time, every couple of days we get some honey, wonderful, yay. All the seeds I could ever want, all the produce I could ever want, any kind of produce I ever want. Everything I want is here. Although I just don't know where Sebastian is any any time at the moment. I really need to try and find him. Like if I see him, orange juice straight away. And Ariel as well. Ariel's really important just because I've just really not had the recipes for him for such a long time. It took me so long to have to get like even one recipe that he liked. It was so bad. You need a present, don't you? Enjoy. Every day oh, you get a present. To drink. But I'm not listening to you every day. Violet and Damon have been telling me how handsome I look as a wolf. Oh. I know they're only trying to make me feel better, but I appreciate it. They're right, you know. You're handsome in any form. Aww. So we're getting something like a 20th of a heart each time. Oh, unlocking these dates is going to get progressively harder, I can tell. I think Ariel... No, shop is closed, so I think it's going to be down here then. A pack of tanukis came through Ravenwood Hollow the other day. Tanukis? They have the cleverest little eyes and hands. I think I know what they are. I'm sure like I'm sure I've seen them in like they were little round dudes in a in a in one of the animes I've seen. They were really cute. Why are humans the dominant species? Hmm? Why can't we live alongside badger dogs instead? I don't know. They, they sound terrifying. Have a peanut roll. Oh, ooh, ooh, ooh. 
I cannot resist. We finally passed half a heart with him. Good grief. And like Perry, no idea. No idea when we're going to get a Perry cutscene. It'll be hard one. Witchling, it is good to see you here. It's necessary for ones like yourself to feel magic under their feet. Can't feel it through the wellies, sorry. <laughs> okay, let's head out to the woods, see, see what I can do about getting this recipe up and going. It might even be that Perry's cutscene is stuck behind uh, his quest. You don't know what cutscenes are stuck behind in this game, so... There's sometimes things that have to happen before. I found something. Yay! A recipe. Corn soup. I never expect it to be malasada, but it would be lovely if it was. All right then. Aha. Money. I'm going to fish in the gloaming today because I've decided that I need to keep fishing in different places. Is it a... Uh... <gasps> it is! Ooh, two today, a nice. Recipe. Very nice. Miso soup. Well, that was one of Kim's favourites, I think. Miso soup. Right then, so... Let's head out to the gloaming. Unless there's anybody else I want to check up on. Kai probably won't be... Well, let's see, has Kai got a shop open today, firstly? If not, I'll have a little look around the beach and just see where. Okay, 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 bye, okay, bye, okay, 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 okay. Oh yeah. Um. Wednesday and Thursday closed. Tuesday is open, so tomorrow would be the time to go and do that. All right then. Want to check in on Parker, see if there's any new progressions with that. Okay. Oh yeah, Juliet. One more piece of tiramisu for you. I think that should be it. Yum. I'm not even hungry, but I'll totally make room for this. Giulietti Moretti, you are finally at the top of your heart. Brilliant. And there's something, There's she's going to have some kind of cutscene, I think. Because it didn't just say friend like it did with uh, Emmy and Finn, so cool. I'm looking around here to see if I can find Bastian anywhere. No idea where he is, I haven't seen him in ages. I can't give presents to him at Coven though if he if he does turn up at Coven. So anyway, I did want to go fishing in the gloaming. I did manage to give a couple of presents out today that I wanted to. Oh good, wool weed. Wonderful. So probably getting through here is one of the only things I'm actually gonna struggle I'll with. Need a levitation no, I got a bridge. I got a bridge. It's fine. We can go over the bridge. I don't need to go down there. I think it's just here, isn't it? Here and in the pond. So I'll just go between the two of them and see if ever a bottle pops out. If it doesn't, then I've got plenty of compler fish. But yeah, I'm going to keep trying different destinations, 
see which ones have the best stuff. You want to bite any day, any day soon? No? Oh, quick up! I've been told in no uncertain terms that people have found things in the gloaming, but it seems like it might be a little bit more rare. So we're not sort of not sort of uh, holding our breath that we'll find anything here necessarily, but it's worth a try because it might be something magical. It takes ages to bite as well. So three fishing events, zero bottles. Let's go and see if the other uh, one has respawned or whether you don't really get to try again in here. Yeah, it looks like unlike some of the other spots that you can fish in, you don't really get to try again in here. They don't really respawn in the same way. Okay. So I might, I'll either need to come here like morning and night or something or I'll just need to come here once a day and do a bit of fishing. And that's going to take a little chunk off my magic each time so I'll eventually need to top that up with some flowers but I do have plenty of those as well. Okay, I think maybe a little bit of mine fishing might be good now. See what comes out of the mines today. So far we've had a couple of we got a couple of ones from a couple of recipes from the uh the mountain. Nothing from fishing so far today. Ooh, ha, gotcha. So we've tried fishing on the beach. The beach didn't really give us anything. Tried fishing at the lake and we got a we did get a recipe at the lake, I think. No recipes from the gloaming, and we've had a few recipes from the mountain so far as well. So I might try fishing up at the mountain tomorrow. Oh, Catching all the same stuff as well. We're not going to ever catch that thing. That thing we didn't catch yet from here. There's still one thing left. Oh, yeah. Grotto sculpings and loaches, that's all we ever catch. I'll try and catch that redfish. Oh, actually, no, we'll try and catch the bottle. It's always whenever I'm like, oh, that's an interesting looking fish. That might be a bit rare. A bottle pops up every time. Is that a bottle? Chocolate With coconut truffles. I think that's a thing that, uh, yeah, I think that's a thing that uh, Ariel likes as well. We're getting there with it. Oh, and another one. Wow. This is the fishing spot today, isn't it? Wow. Oh, yes. Hang on. This this isn't a fish. It's Oh, it's the flounder recipe. sandwich recipe. That might be a good one for Bruno. I'm not sure though. I've got to do a few potions for him. Um Okay. That was really good. We've got two recipes we've got like four recipes or something today, I think. Or three. Three or four, something like that. Huh. Oh, that one. 
I doubt the mine is going to give me anything else today, but we'll keep trying, I guess. I'd be a bit greedy to expect much more. Oh! Quick! It's hard not to react to that. And she's like, oh, quick, oh, go. And I'm like, no, hold, 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 is go. It, uh, it is a recipe. Rumbledy thumps. <laughs> it's called Rumbledy thumps. That's amazing. So that has really filled in the old recipes, hasn't it? Good grief. So still three to do there. Rumbledy thumps. I bet that's something in here. No? Maybe here? There it is. Under cooking. Well, one, two, three, four, five recipes there. One, two, three, four, five, six there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven there. Three there. So we've still got like about 30 recipes to go. Like we definitely are going to still get more. Uh, I will keep going and I'll see what we can get. That's a purpley looking fish. Let's see if we can hook that. Provided a recipe doesn't pop up, which it hasn't. So let's see what we can get. We've done great for recipes today. We've got like four or five new recipes today. That's so good. A golden catfish. We just finished the mine. A bright yellow catfish with no eyes. An epic catch. Sell it for Bruno. We'll cook with it. So we have finally actually completed something. Uh, we've actually completed the mine catchers as well as the gloaming catchers. So now we just need two mountain catchers. Uh... Five ocean, two lake, and quite a lot of the river. I never fish at the river. I think that's what we should do tomorrow, fish at the river. But that was a great time in the mines. I, I think the mine still has things to, to offer, you know? In fact, let's, yeah, let's fish at the river. See what comes out. One. Fishy's always up here, so I don't come and fish up here, see? Although I think Fishy might have run out of uh might have run out of bait at this point. I'm not sure. Did you run out of bait, Fishy? <laughs> oh look at this. You haven't run out of bait actually, have you? You've still got a couple of hundred crickets, which says to me you've maybe run out of your, um... Give you all the worms, I'll give you all the crickets by keeping the chub. Did you run out of your diamond? Hey, fishy. Go fish. Seems so. And time for bed again. Is it time for bed? Uh-huh. So we've got some good cutscenes today. We've got a cutscene with Bruno. We've got a cutscene with um, Shelby so far. So those two, uh, Shelby's finished now. Which I didn't think would happen for ages. We went on a date, which is gorgeous. Oh. Yeah. There is only so many times you can hear that detective novel spiel. Um. It's not my forte, but 
Could I help around the farm? We're a team, and I want to do what I can to support you. It'd really make my day if you could water the plants. I'm on it, sweetheart. I will always let him water the plants. Okay. Let's go see if we can find Ariel. Might be a bit early in the morning, actually. Yeah. Too early. Anything on the board, though? Zephyr's Mood Reviver, one for Perry, one for Violet. Nobody that I need to do anything for. Okay. Really only interested in Ariel at this point. I'll pop back in after nine o'clock. Uh, maybe my cauliflowers are done today. I'm not sure. We'll have to have a look at that one. Hello, tiny squirrel. Money. Money. No one else in the world has ever had such bad luck as me <laughs> getting this recipe. Jeez. I have now got two recipes that Ariel likes. It took me long enough to even find one recipe that Ariel liked. We now have two out of, I think, the four. So uh, if we have a quick look at Ariel. We have the Brigadero and the uh, Pacaquina, I think. We don't have the drink or the Malasada. And I apparently can't find the last... Dirt pile. No, there should be one more. Definitely, somewhere. Being short changed today. Did we buy the onsen? No? No? Maybe there's only two dirt piles today, or... I don't know. Right, I'm gonna go and check my greenhouse for some cauliflowers and see if we can finish off a little task there. This is definitely slowing down at this point with the quests that have been given. I'm kind of relying on you guys to tell me when things are finished, but I definitely don't think they're finished yet because Parker's still got two things that I haven't done. I think the cauliflowers might be tomorrow. Yeah, one more day. Okay. That is fine. I'm going to do a little bit of river fishing then, I think. Either that or we could go and give... Well, like, let's go find Cameron. Let's go and find Cameron. Probably will be at the Consciousness Center today, I think. Natalia and Angus, I love how they're friends. It's gorgeous. Hello. Oh, and Sebastian is in here, of course. That makes sense. Where else would a teen hang out other than the cool, hip, like, hip 50s diner? Yeah. I heard you helped Damon make some zero-proof ale for Bruno. I did. It's a big step in the right direction. I took the liberty of writing Otto to let him know. Don't know if he'll get my letter, but I hope he does. That'd be amazing. I do need to drop by the Consciousness Center sometime. Uh, there they are. I avoided Cameron before because I thought he was a bit oh, creepy, but... I shouldn't. I'm trying this new whole body diet. No, oh, but I'm allowed a cheat day. You can have a cheat day every day. Maybe I should find something else. Oh! I see. So we need to find Cameron at the right place. Hmm. Right, Sebastian! Orange juice for you, I think. Sadly, I don't have pancakes at the moment. Only two left, but I, th I think I've got some more oranges, so... I think he was really close. Yeah, I'll eat anything when I'm hungry. 
I want to hear what you've got to say about things actually Ma's as well. Been quiet since mom came back. It's like she doesn't know how to act now that she doesn't have to step in for mom. Hmm. That's hard when you've had a role for four years and then it's suddenly you don't need to be anymore. She can be a child again, but she's not a child now. So there we are. So Sebastian is also finished up. So Sebastian, Lena and Violet are all going to have cuts news at some point somewhere. Going to check along the beach uh, and see if Kai's around. Gel be on his little beach walk. I love him. Hazel always used to walk around loads as well. She was like, yep, I'm gonna walk to the coven every day. That was adorable because she totally could have taken the broom, but the broom was maybe she was just like she maybe Shelby and Hazel don't feel as confident on a broom. There's every chance of that, you know. But yeah, he's not down here, he's not along the beach at all. Where might Kai be? I think I gave, yeah, I already gave Wesley some stuff. I think I'm going to do a little bit of uh, woodland fishing today. I would like to hang around there just in case anybody who pops up there. Give them a gift or to do a cutscene with them or something. Anybody around at the moment? Not really. Okay, well, we'll just do a little bit of fishing, see if anyone shows up. See if we get any recipes. See if the recipe is the one I need. It's going to be like Quick. the last recipe I ever get in the game. And there'll be one recipe left and it will be that recipe. <laughs> I'll be 84 years old and we're still waiting for that recipe. I'll get the redfish. Oh! Ah, let's get that fish. Gotcha. That's kind of a red fish. Oh, that was worth it. Yay, new fish. Perfect. Hey, Violet. Juliet. Sebastian's been so happy since his mom came back. It's been ages I since I've done that, actually. Forget it. It's a stupid thought, anyway. You wish your dad could come back. Of course you do. Sadly, I really think your dad is actually, you know, dead and buried. And that's horrible. Oh, quick! Got one! Caught a catfish. Get back over here, see if that one's respawned. Yep. That's the nice thing is you can just keep going. So you know, you can, if you've got time, got one. You can just keep on trucking. No, no other cover members around here though. So at least I know that Juliet's cutscene is like going to be in the woods or whatever. Unless it's at a particular time, particular date, la la la. Gotcha. What are you? Had no recipes from this pond today, though. Maybe the mines is like the secret place, because that's where I found the most recipes so far. You look like a funky purple fish. Oh, yeah. A black crappy, a freshwater fish with black spots. Epic catch. So how are we doing with wood the, the, the like lake fish then? I was going the wrong place, didn't I? Oh, we've got all the lake fish now. 
So it's only now the mountain, ocean, and river fish. Cool. Well, in that case, why don't we go do a little bit of river, river fishing? Couple of spots there I can try. Fishy's here. I don't. Ho I hope you don't mind if I fish with you, Fishy. This feels very sociable, doesn't it? Oh, got one! At least here I'll be catching new fish potentially. I found a gar. Is it a gator gar or a golden gar? <laughs> Coral Island watchers will know what I mean. Spent a long time trying to get those fish. We got them eventually, though. Doing really well with stuff in Coral Island. Uh, just... Uh -huh. oh, quick! Nope. Not happening. Ah. Waiting for that bottle to pop under the water. Cheese souffle! Yay! We can just keep on trying. Like, it did say you'll get it eventually if you keep on trying. So I'm gonna try here because here is a place I haven't fished much. Go on, fishy! Catch those fish. Oh, quick! No, I think I'll try and catch that lobster looking thing. That might be something cool. Oh, yeah. She's like, get out of my way. An eel. Okay. Let's see if the spot down here has respawned. Which it has. Lovely. Sorry about so much fishing this episode, but... It'll be worth it when we can do the quest. Oh yeah. Days and days and days of fishing and digging and fishing and digging and fishing and digging. Haven't had a single bottle in this thing, so that's what I'm expecting. No. It's okay. I. I yeah. Didn't want anything from that catch. So we found a new thing in the river now, so I'm getting closer to finding all the fish, which is quite cool. Is it time for bed? Yes. <sighs> so tired. I feel like we need to cure Wesley. Uh, I don't know. I feel like that might be stuck behind something else. Let's make some clothes. Oh, I am slow today. Oh, no. Can I make myself another speedy incantation? I don't have the silver for it. Now, this is where we use instant brew powder. <laughs> And then we put another one on for later use. That is why I did that. <laughs> we'll put a few of those on actually. I'll do like five or so of them. I also want to know what Bruno likes. So let's see if we can do that. Hmm. Oh, I think I see something. Fried flounder sandwich. Oh, what did I just get? Fried flounder sandwich. I know I can make that, so that's amazing. Fried flounder sandwich. Chopped cheese sandwich. Probably would be something that I do in a pan, I would expect, actually. Yeah. What? So what don't we have? Bread and some kind of animal fat or oil. Okay. Let's go and make some olive oil. 
Oh, did I do my incantation? Please tell me I did. Yes. The time for walking slow is done. Quicken my feet and make me run. Lovely. Let's run fast. Okay. I need some more. Oh, no, I don't need more orange juice, actually. Sebastian's finished. Again, just running around waiting for cutscenes. And they can happen when they happen with them. Um, they don't need multiple cutscenes, whereas, like, Gloria, for example, does. Bruno just needs one more. Lena needs more than one. So, Lena, I'm kind of really wanting to get that done so I can kind of try, kind of try and get to be her best friend. It's really difficult. So, olive oil. Can make it here. And then we need some bread. I think I have all the stuff I need to make bread. I forget where it was. In the oven. There we are. Let's make 10 bread. And let's use that to make a few flounder sandwiches. Oh. Only with a flounder. Oh, okay. Well, I may, I've got one. I think I've got like probably three because I think he gave me a couple. I won't have eaten those. Yeah, we got four of them, so that might actually be enough. Uh, the other thing we can do is see if Fishy managed to pick up any flounders recently. You got any flounders? No. Okay. A bit rare or something, maybe. Well, that's fine. Four might actually be enough, and if it isn't, I'll try and find something else that... Uh, the Bruno lights. That'll be fine. Right. The the ever never ending quest for the Masaladas is <laughs> continuing. No, just money today. Ah. Please, I need another dirt pile. Ah, uh, okay. No, it was all money. <laughs> no. Right, I want to try to do some mountain fishing today. Also, oh, do you know what I can do today as well? As well as fish all day. I think my cauliflowers will be ready for giver. So if we can get some of those quests out of the way that, you know, all the ones we can, all the ones we can do then maybe that'll make way for new things to happen. I can't believe I didn't have two cauliflowers at the time. It was kind of annoying, but they should be ready now. Poor old planty. He just comes in here, like, dutifully watering all these plants, and I'm like, yeah, I can't even be bothered to plant anything in them right now. So if we... Oh, there's honey as well today. So if we head on up the mountain, we can give, give her the stuff. Um, and I really need to get that last mulberry tree from Kai and then I can like organize my trees and stuff and work out like a nice way around for them to be. So I'm hoping Giver will be up in the observatory, but uh, I don't really pay attention too much to when <laughs> things are open, so <laughs> maybe not. It takes me ages to learn like all the different opening times. They're shut at the moment. Uh, closed on Monday to Friday. Only open at the weekend. Oh, of course, teaching at the school on weekdays. Ah, right. So that will be where we need to go. Well, that makes sense. So the observatory is doing way less work now, but then it makes sense as well because the the mystery has been solved. So kind of we did need to give give us something else to do, didn't we? Let's run over to the school then. And then I'll just do... Maybe I'll fish in the mines again? I don't really know. I mean, the last time I was in the mines, loads of stuff popped up, so... And I'm not worried about getting every single thing, because some of them might come from quests and stuff like that. Every single recipe, I'm not that worried. Ah, hello. 
What this? Tara! Just the farming gal I was hoping to see. Can I help you with something, Mayor Miranda? I think you may have just missed it last year, but we always have a festival to celebrate the return of spring. The spring fling. Oh yeah, because there wasn't a festival in the spring last year. Yeah. Ooh, like a dance? Well, no. We always put up a big maypole just covered in colorful ribbons. Ooh. When my husband was mayor, we always had the tallest maypole for miles around. I'm not letting Milkwater beat our record on my watch. Let nice. me guess. You'll need wood? And fabric for the ribbons. Bring them to Parker when you're ready. Thanks, Tara. I knew I could count on you. The festival starts in 12 more days. Wood and dyed cloth so that Parker can make the maypole. So we need some red cloth and some purple cloth. I think I can manage red and purple cloth. Uh, let's head... Oh yeah, it was the school we were going to, wasn't it? And give her here is your cauliflower. I got all the spices I'd need for the puff budgie from Kai. Now I just need the vegetables. And voila, here they are. Oh, this is perfect. Thanks, Tara. I'll let you know how my picnic gambit works out. Lovely. I uh, don't need to talk to give her too much. I could have a chat just to see how she's doing and what her... <laughs> Violet was grumbling about doing the arrangements for the spring fling. I can't say I've ever met a florist who didn't like flowers. <laughs> yeah, but she prefers fashion to flowers. If you knew anything about her, you'd know that. Doesn't look like Juliet gave me a bouquet has... and said I could give it to anyone I wanted. Like, I would die of embarrassment if I did that. I wonder if I have to catch her maybe in the cafe with her mom or something along those lines. And who is this stranger who is gracing me with her presence? Is this my wife? I love these two. They're they're so cute. Cut it out, Parker. <laughs> Come on, Lena. I'm just teasing. You work too hard. The shop, the kids, visiting your dad in Milkwater. At least you should take time to hang out with your friends. Like this lovely lady. Am I right, Tara? It's all about balance. I think you might have a point, Parker. But Lena has to find a balance in her life that works for her. Look, I know Parker is right. I just don't know how to make more time in a day to actually do the relaxing part. Maybe chat to Shelby about that? <sighs> you know, I wish I had more time to spend with my friends. Really, I do, Parker. But then I really don't have that many close friends anymore. I haven't done the best job keeping up with people. I am glad you moved back, Tara. It's been so nice rekindling our old friendship. This is Lena's cutscene. Finally. Finally I found it. I'm like thinking this is this is behind all the all the stuff. Like this is before he knew about her being a witch, definitely. There we are. Lena, Lena. But it looks like I've already done the work to get the final cutscene wherever it is. Perfect. But anyway, Parker, it's not often that she's in Parker's workshop, so that's an interesting one. Right, so, uh, yeah, Maple, not yet, I guess. I'm glad we found that eventually. Gloria's due one as well, I don't know where that will be. I think Gloria is you. Yeah, I'm sure she is. I'm sure she is. Hmm, something's in my mailbox. Come by my shop when you have a free moment. I could use your help with something. Okay. I think we've still got a minute to get over there. What do you need? Ah, it'll be the spring fling stuff, won't it? Tara. I'm so glad you're here. Mom wants this year's spring fling to be bigger and better than ever before. I'm wrapping bouquets as fast as I can, but I can only conscript Sebastian when he's out of class. I know spring is planting season, but could you maybe grow some flowers? 
Sure and thing. And make bouquets with a crafting table. Sure thing. Okay, one floral wonderland coming up. Thanks for your help, Tara. We're gonna blow milk water out of the... water. Five spring bouquets. And that can now be made on your... sewing machine, maybe? No, bouquet table can now be constructed in your tool shed. Ah! Ha, 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 ha. Yes, yes. New thing for the tool shed. Got a little bit of room in there, I think. <laughs> Should be able to squidge it in. Right, bouquet table. How do we make a bouquet table? We need ten glass for it. Okay, so let's start making some more glass. Two and a half batches will do it. I just kept all of those glass makers. I was like, oh, I'm probably going to need them. Uh, we need to make some purple and some red cloth, don't we? Ah, I don't have anything to make silk with at the moment. Is the mulberry tree ready? It is indeed. I do want to get a second one, though. I am running out of the leaves quite, quite consistently at this point. Next time, no big hurry about it, but like next time I pop by Kai's and see that... Uh, Oh, I only got one leaf that time. Eek. And see that he's open. So, uh, it was red dye and purple dye. I'm probably going to need to make the purple dye. I need to grab the blueberries. Let's go through and just make a whole big batch of copper. We're going to make some more crystal ball potions. The silver's good for my running potions. Uh... I can make a couple. Let's have those going for a sec. Let's... It's empty. Okay, empty. Empty, empty. Let's make purple dye. Some more red dye. I always have stuff for red dye because mine just brings me back a million clay. Um... Right, so I think I want to make the cloth there. I don't have enough wool for it at the moment. Right, okay. Let's see. Can I make cloth out of the wool I have? Yes. Make just enough. Just enough, indeed. So let's make some purple cloth. Let's make some red cloth. Lovely. We're making the glass for the bouquet table. That's going to take a little while. Probably take me a day or so to make that. Let's give Wesley a... <laughs> Suddenly everything's like, I've got stuff to do again. I'm going to give him a roast pork today, I think. Because I feel like I want to give him something different. Oh, my word. Thank you. Hazel used to make this for me, but your version? It smells even better. Nom nom. Coming to the end of the day, though. Um, so... Tw we've got 12 days to prepare which is fine. So the purple and the red cloth is being done. The bouquet table is being made. The festival starts soon. We need to just carry on trying to find the Malasada. But it's nice having things to do alongside that as the game is trying to give me things to do. It's like, hey, let's do a festival. We never did a festival last spring. So how about we do it now? And I appreciate that a lot. Right, let's cut down these little tiny trees because they get right in the way of my fishing. They're very annoying. Sorry, little trees. I don't mean to be so mean to you, but, you know, you really are in the way. And when we've done that, I think I'm going to wrap up the episode for today. At the moment, um, Wildflowers is still beating out the... Oh numbers I get on uh, Snacko, so Wildflowers will be what will have precedence over the weekend and Snacko will I think I'll do one or two more episodes on it because I'm enjoying the I am enjoying it but it might have to get ooh oh, quick. it might have to get uh, oh, yeah. 
sorry, I don't want to not talk. I don't want to talk while that and miss the recipe. Is it? It is. Sweet potato and coriander pizza. Right, we can go again. I seem to get the most stuff in the mines and here. Oh wow, two recipes. Oh. I'll talk to you about Snacko after we've done the recipes. Oh. Look like a fish. It's a <gasps> recipe. Woohoo! We did it! We got it! We got it, guys! We fished it out of a pond! Oh, just before bedtime, too. I have been so patient, and my patience has, has finally rewarded me. <laughs> so. We now don't need to look for recipes. We we can still if we want to. We still got three there. One, two, three, four, five there. One, two, three, four, five there. Six. So I've I've definitely got a lot to get still. And I think I'll still carry on like digging around, digging the dirt piles. That doesn't take very long each day. And I'll fish where I can, uh, especially, I think, the mountain. We still haven't found all the fish, have we? So it might be just worth still carrying on doing that just to grab the rest of the fish. And then I'll fish down the ocean for a bit and see if I can grab those fish. And then we'll fish on the river a bit and see if we can grab those fish. Might be worth it. Okay, time for bed. Time Should to end the episode. Oh, I'm so happy that happened right at the end of the episode. Aww. Fantastic. So we'll be able to go and see uh, what the deal is with Ariel tomorrow, and that might push some of the uh, Ravenwood characters along a little bit more. So there we are. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more, please subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. Hope to see you next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome. <laughs>